Welcome to Bahamas Educational Express Science Lesson video, The Sun and Other Objects in Space. In this lesson, you will be able to state what is a solar system, name the planets in the solar system, explain the function of the moon, stars, and sun, Define the terms rotation and revolution. The solar system. The sun and the bodies that move around it form the solar system. The planets and the moons are part of the solar system. A planet is one of the eight large bodies that move around the sun. The moon. A moon is a body that moves around a planet. Most objects in the solar system travel in orbits around the sun. Orbit. What is it? An orbit is a path on which an object travels as it moves around another planet. A planet's object is the oval shaped path that the planet travels around the sun. So here we have the orbit, the solar system, the sun in the middle, and the planets that are orbiting the sun. All planets are in motion. They revolve or they move in orbit around the sun. The movement of a planet along its orbit around the sun is called revolution. Planets rotate or spin like a top. An axis is a straight line that runs through the object. The turning or the spinning of a planet on a, its axis is called rotation. The spinning or the turning of a planet on its axis is called rotation. This causes night and day. Here we have rotation. Revolution. A planet's year is the time it takes that planet to complete one orbit or one revolution around the sun. Revolution causes seasons. Stars. The sun is in the center of the solar system. It is a star. It is 93 million miles away from Earth. Stars are the only bodies that give off radiant energy. It is a ball of burning gases and molten material. The sun and the planets orbiting around. The role of the sun, what is it? The sun provides heat, and light to all of the planets. There would be no life on Earth if the sun stopped giving off radiant energy. Energy from the sun warms the Earth and allows green plants to turn raw materials into food. The sun. 
Gravity. Let's talk about gravity. Gravity on the sun is very strong. This is because of its great size. The entire solar system can fit inside the sun. Gravity is the force of one object's pull on another. Gravity, one object pull on another. The sun's gravity helps hold all the object in the solar system in place or in orbit. The four closest planets to sun are in one group and they are called the inner planets. The inner planets. These planets are Mercury, Venus, Earth, and Mars. They are closest to the sun, smallest planets, have rocky surfaces, warmer than the other planets, have no more than two moons. Mercury, Venus, Earth, Mars, the inner planets. The four other planets are called outer planets. They are Jupiter, Saturn, Uranus, and Neptune. They are furthest from the sun, mostly frozen gases. Surfaces are colder, have many moons have rings of dust and ice around them. Jupiter, Saturn, Neptune, and Uranus. These are the outer planets. Now let us look back at what we have been learning about the planets and the solar system. Can you answer these questions? Question one, how many planets are there? Great, it is eight, you are correct. Question two, which planet is closest to the sun? If you answer Earth, you are correct. Let's go to the next question. Question number three, what is the sun? What is the sun? If you say a star, you are correct. All right, do we have another one? Question four, which planet is known for having rings around it? And if you say Saturn, you are correct. Question five, who was the first person to walk on the moon? Do you know? Take a wild guess if you, if you really didn't study this. That's right, Mr. Neil Armstrong, very good. Question six, which is the largest planet in the solar system? <sighs> Jupiter, you are correct. Great job, guys. Thank you for watching. Thank you for listening. Thank you for learning.